if you get charged with an assault, that is, believe it or not, a very serious charge. Now, if it's in a municipal court, it's not quite as serious. However, if it's at the superior court, there's a large range. You could be charged with a second degree and do up to 10 years, a third degree, do up to five years, a fourth degree, and do up to a year and a half. There's a lot of variables and things it depends upon. That's why you need a really good criminal defense attorney. If the assault, even minor, even feeling physical pain happens to a police officer, it's automatically brought up as an aggravated assault. So when it's, it's an aggravated assault, basically if somebody gets injured, we'll say in, in a big way, seriously injured, once it could fall under the near or the No Early Release Act, where you have to do 85% of the time. So if it's a second degree um, aggravated assault, it falls under the near, that could be eight and a half years, 85% of 10 years. Okay, if it's, even if it's taken down to a small, the lowest end of a second degree for an aggravated assault and they have um, serious injury, that's five years. But because NERA attached, there's no early release act, you have to do four and a half years of the five before you're eligible to get out. Now, if you, if there's other type of assaults where a good attorney, they can get you like probation on them. But there's a lot of degrees of assault, if, depending on is it serious injury, is it significant injury, um, was there not much injury at all? So assaults are very, very common, and there is a, a large range of outcomes that can come as a result. I tell my clients a lot, you don't want to get these violent uh, type of charges because it can prevent you from something called drug court. Drug court means that if you have a drug problem and maybe you'd have to a couple years in jail, you can just get out and get, do, do a drug program for a couple of years, maybe a three to five years drug court program. You don't have to do any jail. If you have an assault, okay, you will not qualify for that. So it's very important that you have this handled by a professional, reputable lawyer that knows what they're doing.